Okay. What was it? Um, this will be a video on how to make a boolean. <laughs> um, well, a surf that looked like it had a boolean effect to it. To her. To her. I think it's really neat. The surf looks like it had, like to where the surf looks like it was eaten away at, like, and the map here, like in my frame, is like, like, like right there and right here. Okay, which it is fairly easy to to make. All you need to use is this plugin. And just, just for now, I'm going to use this to make a basic wall. Let's just say that this is the wall. You can have it be a vertical wall if you want. He's not welcome. And sorry for any background audio that you may end up hearing. Okay, so. For this, I'm going to be using 5 degrees of rotation. That pizza was filling. I. Okay, first like off, it might help if I anchor everything. And also, if I were to, <coughs> let's see here, we're now going to call this a main, which does not need to be called main, it's just that it, it makes it easier for me to tell which one is the main part if I end up ungrouping it. <coughs> so for here, see primary that. part, main, and it will prevent it from doing whatever it's doing. Let's just say that I want it to do this. <coughs> and for this case, I'm going to move the wall to where it will be. Like, if you wanted to have it like this, then you could probably have it still get eaten away at. But this is mainly for, like, if you have nothing behind here, and you don't plan on people going back here or being able to see back there, then this right here would be fine. <laughs> if it was just completely boxed off, but if you were to have it to where. People could access this area, and that oh, the surf just and you want the surf to end before the wall. Then doing something like this will work. For this case, I'm going to be doing having the wall like this. Actually, like <coughs> so. I'm going to have it that that wall. Oh, so yes, this will be what I'm going to be making. So for now, I'm going to get rid of all of these, and I'm going to keep it this one, because it's the first one that intersects the wall. For this case, I'm going to have a part. I also, I normally tend to use one, but at some points, like later on, I'm going to end up being using um, 0 0.5 and 0 0.05, which for now... Also, you could delete this if there's going to be nothing, if there's another one, because you could just arc it back into the location if you remember the angle. For now, I'm going to have it like that. Okay. So for this case, I'm going to keep it one. I'm going to get to where it's flush with that. Right there, you see, you'll see that it's not there, but you can still select it, which will see <coughs> that it's flush with this. Okay, so I'm going to make this one be flush also. Oh. Just so then I can no, remove these two things and it'll just make it easier to see what's going on. And also because you don't really want to have that it because then it will go well, clip through. Not 
and I placed it on the triangle just so then there would be no guessing and also it would always line up with this part perfectly. Well, this edge here. It's not going to always work for here. Like for this case, you can see right there, there's a tiny little gap, but it's small enough that most people are not going to acknowledge its existence. <coughs> so right there, there's the wall. Oh yeah, and also for this... Okay, and also for this example, I'm just going to make it be one side. I forgot <laughs> about that. So it's just going to take a lot more time. So for this one, you want it to where, to where <laughs> this corner here touches the wall. Like <coughs> this. It does not need to be perfect, but <coughs> if anything, you want it to go through the wall just a tiny bit, if you, if at all. Like that. I'm going to connect this up to here. And drag this to where that corner meets there. At this point, you would have a wedge. <coughs> you would have a wedge to go here. If I could. That would explain this. Okay. Beans, beans, beans. Can we just do it like this? I'm doing something on a game on my phone, so I'm, my character, my Warframe, is just idling in a cave, just standing here because I'm not doing anything okay. on it. And yep, it's that, now flush. Um, I'm in a group with. And after this, you, you won't have to. You there. won't have to be. As, like, this is they probably the most frustrating long. part of it is just like, making this games, one part because it's the most effort planes, for um, one segment of it. Let's see here. And behind it is like this huge cave. Group and that. Awesome. Like, I'm right, that main part. Storm. I'm going to do that. Now I'm just going to do <coughs> this until <coughs> it meets the wall or goes into the wall. Then for these, you could just group them because they don't. It does not matter. And for here. For ne from now on, you won't need these parts. Oh, what did I just grab there? Yeah, like clean water. Oh. Yes, he is you won't need that. <laughs> nope, not making fun of him, but that is pretty weird. Okay, from here, like usual, you just drag this corner. I'm gonna have that be transparent. There's no way for you to just like go out and walk around, like have. <laughs> well, with this, you don't have to be this precise, but if you're doing something like what I do with um, a, a poly and a poly, and I don't know how to pronounce it, but if you're doing something like that. Then, yeah, you would need to be able to do this. <laughs> like, and don't just, like, do something like that. It's best to go over here, because you'll see right here. Nice. It but works best if you line it up with it. Your game. <laughs> um, but now, uh, I just need to drag this up. And this one, you just have to eyeball it is, and um, line it up towards like that. Since Marv, uh, and for now, now, Marvin's still, like, a puppy. Yeah, uh, um, make it be point five just you so you can see through it. Can you take puppies out for walks or is it just when they get older? Well, 
Well, I mean, if you were not going to bring him, I can see why you wouldn't want to, like, leave him around. Um, okay, I'm just going to keep this being opaque. Well, I mean, I know how much um, you are enjoying the pets, so I know <laughs> why you're doing what you're doing. Let me see, I'm just going to kind of rush through this. Because in this scenario, if you were to just have a wedge as the the wall, you would not have to be nearly as precise. Cedar. And then just drag it down. We both know as and gamers, extend we it. To games. Okay, so extend it like that. I'm just going to, for this part, I'm just going to extend, <laughs> going to extend this here because later on you're not going to need this because this will be completely main up there. Okay, so let's see here, green. Is River back there looking jealous? Okay, that. I actually worked fairly well because I'd not have to do much micro adjustments. So, um, earlier, uh, like, you know, also, you could ago. later on you could extend um, that up. With the bone here. Around, like, it's not really a bone, but kind of like the spine of so, the okay. surf. Um, and extend this down. And then because I did this, it like, will be a lot easier for me to do this. And like, try not to do something like this. Because like, that. Not look very um, good. Okay, that right there is good. You, you've seen our uh, back porch before, right? Huh. Well, we have like a. Um, Center light can go a little bit to, more. Used to get from our back door to the yard. So. I wouldn't want to have to like walk all the way or down there to wash into the potty. So I brought them to the front yard, and when I was um, okay, so right now out, I could essentially just do this, the and um, <coughs> then you'll get the effect yeah, of it being having a boolean effect. He ran out into the road, so I had to go chase him down, and um. Uh, he would not want to come home, and one of the cars, oh, the crap. second car was our neighbor's, um, and they were pulling into the driveway, and he does not like them. Yeah. It, there Baxter, you go. Baxter apparently is racist. And <laughs> later on, I'm going to have to do something, more things like this for, well, I don't know, it's, it's for, to, like, um, the map. No. I hope this helps people who faster. feel like using this in their map. But it's only that useful. It's only this useful like just for um okay. yeah, yeah, this is only really useful for if you were to have a wall like a wall but separating two rooms. You do not want to be able to see surf through the wall. Anyhow, I was and also, no one, I most was of the time, no one's going to be able to get here if this is against the wall, so it's okay <laughs> to leave it kind of like, kind of empty. And, yeah. One stud is normally big enough to allow people to just go over it. And and also, I don't do anything do here. Keep the, the floor here. If anything, just have like a a part like here with like a wedge, but don't do it the way I'm doing it, because then that would not be correct. Mm. Whoa! There's a meteor shower going on, and they're crashing into the into the ground. I probably should go investigate those, but I'm fishing, 
so that we'll have to wait. Okay, Tori could do something like. <laughs> Old Tori could slam the wall here. You could just throw a wedge here and line it up. So. I don't really use this measurement just because it it's oh. it's good enough for this kind of thing. It is. So I don't know if I've ever made it apparent, but I really love fishing in the games. Um, I find it just really and, fun. And um, yeah, this is basically what you would have to do oh, for oh, something like this. Cool. It's a glowing fish. Looks like it came out of Tron. Um. Anyway, where was I going with this? Oh, yeah. Um, and that is all to this video. Games, but it's funny because and I didn't just about the same time as the previous one, but at least this one is probably a lot easier to understand. Um, and, I don't know, and thank you for watching. It's a lot different.